Okay, so today we will be learning how to call variables from PHP into an HTML page. So let's start off with making our basic PHP tags, and that means the question open caret the I call it open caret. It's really called open bracket, but open caret question mark PHP and then close Q, close question mark and then close caret. So the variables I'm going to decide to call are going to be about me. About the name equals buggy. Dot sign age equals twenty five. Dog sign I equal brown. I think they're brown. I don't really know, but let's say we have ourselves an HTML skeleton. Add title. In our last video, we explained what title does, so. In it twice already. Dash head. Body is where you want to see. Two PR so you can see it without me moving the screen all around. And body. Alright, so let's say. We want to say an H1 tag. We want to say hello, my name is. Let's say you don't feel like typing your name a million and one times. Now you have it stored as a variable. And it's also I have to fix this variable up here. It's stored as a variable. So let's just say we put a PHP tag. Then echo out your name. And then close the PHP tag. Uh, it could be on one line, but I'd rather do it like this so I can know where I'm beginning and ending. And I end the H1 tag. It sometimes is better to do it like this. Where you can see everything that you wrote in the H1. I mean, I can do it either way, it doesn't really matter to me. But let's say, um, another PR. Then we put a P tag, and it says, My age is, then we do it again, PHP, echo. Dot sign age, semicolon, question mark, closing carry, slash P, R, and my eye color is, question mark, PHP, and then echo. That's my eyes. That's what I named it. That's mark only carry. And then period. That's P. Now, when I print all this to the screen, it should automatically show me that. That, hello, my name is Buggy, my age is 25, and my eye color is brown. So, as you can see, all that came to the screen correctly and elegantly. This will allow you to move variables from the PHP over to the HTML using 
the PHP variable so you don't have to keep repeating yourself over and over. Uh, let's see. Number. Numbers do not have to be put in Besides the quotation marks, however, strings do. A string is anything that is has letters within it. That means that it could be a text, a word, a variable with numbers and letters. That would be a string. And this is just an int value, so it doesn't need the, the quotation marks. So that'll be it for today. Thank you, and have a nice day.